back at Wolfgang's Steakhouse by Wolfgang's Wiener, and we're with Manny, and we're in the kitchen because we're on the road. And uh, before we get to the delicious grub behind me, I want to ask you about being a global brand. What does that mean for you guys? Well, for us, it's, you know, we just try to keep it really simple and concise. It's just about uh, serving prime beef the same way every single time and being able to offer that in every country and every continent that we have restaurants in. Okay, explain, I'm a steak guy, yeah. but explain to our viewers and to me, right. USDA prime steak, aged steak. Right. What does that all mean? We get this steak directly from the slaughterhouses. Nothing's ever frozen. Right after the beef is cut, it goes straight to freight. So we get our meat shipped in daily. And what that does is when you cut out the freezing, it allows the meat to kind of keep some of that earthy tone and just produce something that we can put directly into our dry aging rooms where we put it for 28 days. And that allows the meat to really marbleize and enhance and hold a lot of that natural earth flavor. And so it's also important to realize that only 2% of all beef produced in the U.S. is considered prime. So for us, like the dry aging process, it's really important and it's a big part of our brand. And again, it, it adds a certain earthy complexity to the flavor of the meat. All right, we talked about it in the last segment. What are we showing uh, our viewers what they can get if they come down to Wolfgang Steakhouse? What do we got? So what we have here is the T-bone porterhouse, 32 ounce cut. When you have the natural T-bone right here, it's just cut right off of the slab. And so what we do is when we have back here, the first person is the cutter. So they're the one that kind of slices the steak and that's the way like in Hawaii you would say like poo-poo style. So it's kind of something that we do, but this is done globally. So on this side, we have the filet. You got about three pieces cut right here. And then on this side, you have the sirloin and you can see it's all pre-cut and then it's arranged and we just keep it tight around the bone. And then this goes straight into our broilers and then from there straight to the table. Okay, now tell us about what you can get with that massive porterhouse. So some of the traditional sides that we offer, uh, these are found at every steakhouse, but we of course have our own version of it. So this is a cream spinach right here and then mashed potatoes. So these are probably the two of the most popular sides. And then we also have a, a lobster mac and cheese. So you get three different cheeses melted on top with fresh lobster sprinkled in there. And then that just goes in there and gets grilled at the top. And then that's it. So when we come back, I'm going to have the most uh, fortunate job of tasting all of that. We'll be back. Wolfgang Steakhouse by Wolfgang's Wiener. Manny's going to feed me when we come back. You had that mask on, but I could see your smile was like grinning ear to right? ear. <laughs> you, you can see the you can see the whole the, this part. Yes, that steak and sides. But, Mm. It's like uh, it's like I have the most fortunate job of We're having so to eat this. How terrible! <laughs> um, look, if the behind the scenes thing mm. didn't get you pumped up about having to, you know, about eating some steak and some yes. lobster <clears throat> mac and cheese or mashed potatoes, or sweet <laughs> spinach, I'm gonna make you feel even worse about yourself a little later <laughs> in the show. Stick around for that. <laughs> <laughs>